What's broken now? Listen up. I know you're all having fun down there, but the grid is overloaded again, so maybe you could switch off your personal consoles or your lawn mowers or whatever the hell you've all decided to switch on all at once. I might not be around to babysit you for a while, and you don't want stuff breaking while Pellegrino's in charge, do you? That's it. That's it. Don't worry, Wonkay. I see you there in the elevator. I'll have you moving again in a jiffy. Great way to start life in the city, eh? What the hell is a jiffy? These bloody language libraries. on there. You're the newbie, aren't ya? Number 1000. I figured the dam would go dry before we reach the goal. I have a question. How does it feel to you to be born with a randomized psyche into a society of autonomous thinking machines which so much resemble their long extinct ancestors they've decided it's best that you're the last one ever made? Do you want to get on the non-cooperative path with me? Because that's how you get on the non-cooperative path. It's not fun.
What? So, the algorithm assigned you the optimism trait. If only we could all be so... Now listen. This meeting isn't strictly happenstance. I have some friends. The kind of people who like to know what's going on with other people. They think you can help each other out. Of course you are! You know how to use the interface, right? I'll talk to my friends and see if I can't play matchmaker. And before you go, a word of advice. Not everything around here is how it appears. Join us at the table. I would like to preface this meeting by saying I told you something would happen sooner or later and you didn't listen to me. And here we are. If we could focus on the issue at hand. The issue at hand is not this one thing, but this entire attitude that's taken hold. The world doesn't cease to exist when you stick your head in the sand, Herman, or under a dome, as it were. Let's not get sidetracked. We're here to solve this puzzle, not to discuss philosophy. Of course, I'm sorry you've been dragged into this. I'm sure this sort of adventure is the last thing you were looking for on your first day. See? A fresh mind is open to the possibilities. Yakut, I think it's time for the briefing. All right, here we go. Nice to meet you, by the way, 1K. We first became aware of the site-designated TTP-2 during a scouting expedition about six months ago. It's a large island with a remarkably varied geography, and it looks like there are several artificial structures of some kind. We recorded extremely unusual fluctuating energy readings from somewhere in the middle of the island, but couldn't really make sense of them. I wanted to go and have a closer look, but the decision was made that it was too far and not relevant to the goal. 
Now it looks like whatever's on that island has reached out to us instead in the form of that projection. We may not be interested in the island, but the island is definitely interested in us. I don't share your enthusiasm for the unexpected, but Byron has been requesting an expedition for some time now, and at this point I'm forced to agree that it's necessary. I agree. Then it's settled. The expedition is approved. Byron, you will be in charge. Al will be your second in command to ensure a balanced approach. You'll take Melville and Yakut as you requested, and if 1K wants to join you, that's fine by me. Excellent. Oh, this is going to be fun. Come meet us out on the landing pad when you're ready. Before you set out so hastily, do consider exploring the city first. It is your home, after all. That's a good idea. Have a look around. See what you make of the place.